warned you about something, but you lost consciousness. Do you remember what it was? It doesn't matter. Yeah, it does. If it's about Claudia, she's done something that I need to know about. No, I... If I died, Claudia would have nothing to lose. I just wanted you to protect Olivia. Yeah, I get that. But Spinelli was under the impression that there was more. Maybe, maybe I misinterpreted him. No, I don't, I don't think you did. It doesn't matter, Jason. I'm alive. Claudia's no longer a threat, okay? You sure enough about that to bet Olivia's life on it? I have no illusions about my sister, alright? She's not a nice person, but at the end of the day, she's my sister, so don't ask me to turn against her, okay? Okay, if I may offer an admittedly unsolicited opinion, the Mall Prince has proven himself brave and loyal tonight, so maybe Stone Cold can find it in his heart to allow him some time to rest and recover, instead of badgering him with questions that can easily get till tomorrow. Oh, oh, fine, I'm gonna drop Claudia as a subject for now, okay? But I need to know what happened today. I, I already gave you the full report. No, well, I, I understand that, but I need to actually hear this from Johnny, okay? Starting with who's responsible, was it Anthony? Yeah. You're positive about that? Yes, I heard. I didn't want to gun and say. Now, do you, do you think Anthony intended to kill you? Wow. I took the job at the last minute. Dominic was supposed to be in the warehouse tonight on me. How did the Mob Prince endured a night of trauma and pain, but he's, in a way, in, inadvertently responsible for the preservation of a young life. What do you mean? Well, um, due to your generous impulse to trade places with Dominic, he was then available to protect young Morgan Corinthos from certain death at the Carnival of Doom. Yeah, my, my grandfather had a heart attack behind the wheel. <sighs> he lost control, he plowed straight through the carnival, and, and Morgan was in the car's path. Dominic pushed him out of the way and actually took the hit. Yeah, he sustained extensive injuries, but he's gonna survive. That's your grandfather. He's, uh, he's okay, he's alive. I mean, it's gonna be tough for him, but... You know, can you, uh... Can you just give us a moment? Yes, uh, of course. My bride to be awaits. It's been early. It's just thinking about me tonight. It was a privilege to be of help. Hi. Talk to me about taking Dominic's assignment, whose idea was it? Mine. Did, did he encourage you at all? Oh, he was hanging out with Lulu. <laughs> Figured I'd put her through enough crap. So I volunteered to take... Do you think you could have been set up? I'm at a loss here, Jason. I don't see what Dominic would have to gain by setting me up. Johnny. I'm so scared. Please, don't let anything like this happen to you again, okay? If you die, I'm going to take it. Shh. It's okay. I'm not going anywhere. So stop that crying, okay? This is just a lot. We lost three warehouses, a truck yard, and all the Canada shipments. But there was no casualties, right? Johnny's the worst just, of the injuries. Yeah, just Johnny. But let me tell you something. This was not a lucky hit. It was precisely timed and well planned out. There's got to be a plan in the Zakara camp. Now, maybe it's Johnny. I mean, look, he might have got caught in his own trap. Yeah, you know what? It doesn't make any sense. If this was Johnny's no. operation, his men wouldn't have opened fire. He took two bullets to save Spinelli. He could have died. If that doesn't prove his loyalty, nothing ever will. Johnny replaced Dominic. At the last minute. Yeah, I know that. Maybe Dominic was supposed to be in that warehouse. I mean, you know, maybe Anthony considered him a threat. Right? Which would make Dominic loyal to us. Well, I mean, I can see Anthony wanting to take Dominic out because he switched sides. It's believable. Have you ever caught Dominic in a lie or seen anything suspicious? No, so far he's been okay. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna use Dominic. It is time to neutralize that old freak, Anthony. I'm 
won't be on mine. I came by to see you and I decided to wait. No, I don't. I don't mind. Long day. I heard. I mean, the, the stuff at the carnival clearly, and then the Zakaris decided to attack? Yeah, Johnny got shot. He's hurt pretty bad, but if it hadn't been for him, Spinelli couldn't be dead. Wow, okay, so I guess we both owe Johnny a debt of gratitude. Spinelli said that Anthony set this whole thing Yeah, Anthony's he's doing everything from prison right now, which is practically, it's going to be impossible to... You know, how, how, did, how did your case go? It's complicated. Um, <clears throat> you know, I, it's challenging, and, and it's good, because it's why I wanted to be a PI to begin so with, right? Can you do me a favor? Mm -hmm. if, if things do get, you know, too dangerous, just call me. Okay, I don't, I don't want you to be another close call. Oh. Yeah, I can I can take care of myself. <laughs> you would be the first person I would call. It's good. Spinelli and Maxie around. What do your ears tell you? <laughs> Thank God they <laughs> must have gone over the place. I've never heard two people so loud in my entire life. Yeah. Um, well, I'm glad they're not here tonight. Yep. You're recovering from two gunshot wounds and you need to rest and I need to go to the office and work. Is it something that has to be done tonight?